Good morning. We're in Mount Carroll at Point Rock Park. We're about to paddle the Carroll Creek. The shuttle starts by going south from the park on Mill Street to Highway 64. Turn right and take 64 to Jacobstown Road. Here you'll turn right again. The takeout is just upstream from the bridge. The put-in at Point Rock Park is very nice with great parking and an easy approach to the creek. There's no water level gauge on the carrel. The best way to judge if there's enough water in it for paddling is by looking at the low bridge in the park. If the water is near the top of it, you're good to go. If it's over the top, you may want to reconsider paddling it. Even at the level you see here, there's great potential of getting swept into a strainer or undercut rock face. We suggest that only experienced paddlers attempt to Carroll Creek, no matter what level it's at. The Carroll Creek is probably one of the nicest streams I've ever paddled. From its towering fern-covered limestone cliffs, to its narrow intimate sides and fast challenging current, it has everything I enjoy in a stream. Unfortunately, along with the creek's many wonderful attributes, comes a major drawback. Due to the relatively small size of its watershed and the creek's steep six and a half feet per mile drop, the Carroll seldom has enough water in it for paddling. The creek takes a few inches of rain to fill up, and since it drains out as quickly as it fills, there's a very narrow window of time to paddle it. One more attraction for paddling the creek is its many caves. One of them was dug deeper into the bedrock by miners after they discovered a vein of lead. It's difficult to get to the entrance, but it's well worth the effort. I thought for sure it was gonna go all the way through. Look at their last drill hole. This strip is a short one, only about six and a half miles long, so take your time paddling it. Due to its finicky water levels, there's no telling when you'll get another chance to witness the beauty and excitement of this spectacular little stream. The takeout at Jacobstown Road is undeveloped, but still very nice. See you in the next river.